Tawid, what does he mean? Unity. What does Tawid mean? Unity of God. Unity. unity. Yeah. To have a unity, is that meaning more than one? To be unified? No. Ah, so no. how can you have unity then? One of the Ten Commandments, don't bow down to any graven image on the heavens or earth. So why do Muslims bow down and kiss a rock? I kiss my mom as well. He's just compared his mother to a rock in Mecca. Is Allah's knowledge eternal? Is Allah's knowledge living? Yes. Is uh, the knowledge of Allah limited? No. In any way? No. How is this not God? You've lost the debate and you've lost the debate because all you do is listen to Golden Shower Boy over there. I don't disagree with you, no, but that's not in the Bible. In the Bible, Jesus clearly says that he's got a God. Yeah. But again, 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 you, you're... And he prays. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you know, you know what the problem is? Oh, Father the, the, the in heaven. Yeah, yeah. The, the problem that you Muslims have got. No, it's not me Muslims. It's people. I'm just going to say it back. A problem that Muslims have yeah. when they engage in these kinds of discussions yeah. is that they, bring they, the Bible. Are, they have only got they have only got slithers of information because they learn about Christianity through the likes of Muhammad Hijab mm. rather than coming and talking with Christians. They don't come here. Yeah. No, no, no. I stood here. You didn't come and talk to me. No, no, but that's why. No, I was stood here to talk to him, and then yeah, yeah. you started talking to me. Yeah, yeah. You didn't come and find a Christian to talk to. You. So again, don't pretend that you're here to talk to me. Yeah, but what you say? Whatever I found so, you, you found me. Yeah. Whatever you're saying so, doesn't make sense. So, so, so making make sense. So the, the, the problem that, that, that Muslims generally have is that they take their information from the likes of Zaki and I and Ahmed Dan and Shabir Ali, and they don't actually sit down and study with Christians what the Christian faith. Okay, that's why I'm asking you. Yeah, yeah, let me. So now we'll go to the New Testament. Yeah, I've shown you that the earliest Christians worship Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. I showed you that. And I, just so my, my question, my question. So I had a question. Uh, yeah, okay, sure. Me. My oh, question was, why would Jesus pray to a God if He's God? That is a, a fair question to, um, to answer. So you know that we Christians believe in a Trinity. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. And we Christians believe that, that the divine Logos, that is Jesus Christ, takes on to himself a human nature. What are you dependent on? Now, when he takes on the human nature, he is representing Israel. You've got to understand a lot about what the Bible teaches. It's backed up context. Yeah. I mean, and, and I can explore some of that with you. But very briefly, I'll just give you a, a, a brief synopsis. God establishes covenants with through history. Establishes one with Adam. Establishes one with Noah. Then he establishes one with Abraham. Then he establishes one with Moses. The one he establishes with Moses is the idea that a faithful Israel will meet a holy God. But then the whole story of the Old Testament is how Israel is not faithful. Thus it is short of the covenant promise. And there's no answer to this. In fact, that, the whole point of that was to demonstrate that human beings couldn't be holy as their Father in Heaven was holy and needed God. I'm answering his question. Yeah, and, and so they, they need an intervention. And God provides that intervention. He becomes a man. And in Jesus Christ, a man, a holy, a, a faithful Israel meets a holy God. The Son, the Son has eternally spoken with the Father. He, even before his incarnation. At his incarnation, he continues to speak to his father. But now he's a human being, we call it prayer. Do you believe that was this? So before he was on earth, we did it like a separate kind of... But who's going to sit on the throne? Allow me to address the lady. So we, we as Christians believe that the, the divine unity, the divine essence, exists as Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Always. So, always, and has always before the incarnation. Even before the incarnation. So let me just give you an explanation and then how we, how we can know that three is one and one is three. Because lots of people say, well, how can three be one and one be three? Well, you're standing in three-dimensional space right now. We have this dimension of space, we have this dimension of space, we have this dimension of space. These are distinguishable dimensions, the experience of the world, and they are the same thing, essentially. But we can distinguish the three dimensions from one another. We don't confuse the horizontal with the lateral with the vertical. They're different. So, exactly, thank you. They are distinct, but they are one, because each one is the same as the one. In what way one? Because, well, are you stood in, are you stood in space right now? Yeah. Do you experience it as three things or one thing? 
sometimes treating back and front. No, you always experience it as three. Even if you're not conscious of it. Because you're, you're a three-dimensional creature. You've got three dimensions, bro. So whether you're conscious of it or not, you experience space. Okay, but we're talking apple and pear. Can we talk about... So I was using that as an analogy to demonstrate that we can think of three as one and one as three. That's all I was demonstrating, is that this is not an illogical statement to make. Because we experience it. Oh, well, it's logical on the three dimension. It's not very logical. Thank you for accepting that it is a logical statement. Now, when we talk about God, yeah. we say that whatever God is, that thing that makes God God, yeah. Yeah, yeah, the Father has it, the Son has it, and the Holy Spirit has it at the same time. No, they don't. Yeah, why are you trying to tell me my beliefs now as a Christian? You're telling me that Jesus, oh, Jesus wait, 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 wait. is the same with God. Sorry, did you just try to tell me my beliefs as a Christian? I'm trying to understand what you're saying. Are you saying no, 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 you said no, they don't. So you're trying to tell me my okay. beliefs, or are you trying to ask me my beliefs? Tell me, tell me what you said. Tell me what you said. Okay. What did you say? What so did let you say? me say it again. Gentlemen, yeah. calm down. Yeah. 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 We like, 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 yeah. That yeah. thing that God is, yeah, yeah, yeah. Better way. the Father has it completely, the Son has it completely, and it the Holy Spirit. Exactly it doesn't saying. though. So you're telling me my beliefs. Is, is this, ah, Jesus is not God. God. God doesn't pray to God. One second. Are you that telling me my beliefs? beliefs? You asked me about what, what I said, believe. From what you said before, <laughs> from what you said before, it doesn't make sense what you're doesn't saying now. Of course, you, because you're here to prove a point. No, 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 you're here to prove a point. You're here to tell me with a book so to tell me that the truth is. Explain to me. Explain to me. Explain to me. Explain to me. And it doesn't exist in your mind either. Explain to me. You're not sure of it. You're not sure of it. No, I'm completely sure of it. You're not sure of it because you just told me one thing. Hold on a second. So you've gone, no, I haven't. You've gone from telling me what my beliefs are to now telling me what my emotional state is. Oh, are you are. a prophet? <laughs> you've got, you've got should, three, I, should, I, should I be like, sitting here like, and writing notes because you're, you're a prophet? Like you've got three guns. You've got, you've got three guns. Is, is God speaking to you now? Now you've got three guns. Is God speaking to you now? Okay, okay. Check, okay. give me a third story then. No, no, no. Give me a third story. I haven't changed at all. Give me five stories. Bob, 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 Bob. This is where I start shouting. This is where I start shouting. Guys, guys, guys. Come on, come on. This is where I start shouting. We need to keep him calm. Yeah, let's keep him calm. This is where I start shouting. Would you like some water? No, no, I've got some sure. Thank you. Would you like some water? No, I have. No, okay, okay, brilliant. Great. We're all good with water. Then. It's coming. It's coming. Uh, yeah, it's coming. Definitely. So my point to you is, yeah, what what would be better, right? Muslims like to call themselves students of knowledge. Yeah. No, I've never called myself. We're all students. We're all students. Muslims like to talk about themselves no, as being students of knowledge. I know that. I know Muslims. We're like, we're like you to might study. not, but maybe that says something about your pride. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. Tell me the first thing. 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 No, I didn't say it was about your belief. I said what I heard Muslims say. You've got to keep up with this conversation, bro. I'm trying to keep up with your three guys. I'm trying to keep up with your three guys. You said, you just said, I believe in three gods. Yes. Can you show me anywhere in this Bible that teaches that? No. I agree. Nowhere. That's the point. Do I believe in this book? I hope so. So, if we all agree that this book doesn't teach a belief in three gods, and you all agree that I believe in this book, why do you think I believe in three gods? Because you keep saying. That's that, the question. No. And you know what the answer to that is, sister? The answer is, you're wrong. Okay, I'm thinking gods. I believe in three gods. No, no, no. That's the answer okay, guys, to the guys, question. Guys, guys, guys. How many come gods? Come down, come down. How many gods? I, 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 I will be generous. Look, listen. He, he might think, because he says, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, they are all the same, and they're all equal. So, is the Father, okay, is the Father God, mighty God, the Creator? My question is, is he the Father? He is, but Jesus is not, according to him, Jesus is not the Creator. He doesn't create. He didn't exactly. create. He's been the created. Father. He created Jesus. That's how we believe. That's okay. The Holy Spirit. Yeah, exactly. We're not even go know. there. But that's not what we believe. That might be what you say we believe. Ah. But that's not what we. Do believe. you believe the Father is the Creator? Do you believe Jesus has been created by God? So what would help you? What would help? What would help you, Father, is the Creator? What would help you, brother? And what would help you, brother, is if you actually approach this conversation with some humility and try it and recognize the fact that you don't know as much as you think you do. Okay, about what we've got. Okay, teach us, teach us, teach us. Right, okay. okay. So what would help? 
in this teaching moment yeah. is for you not to prescribe beliefs to me that I do not have. Okay, no, 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 no. But when, 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 it doesn't make when you sense, change your study, when it I have not changed it. If it doesn't I make sense. I have not changed it one iota. But, 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 if something you utter, it doesn't make sense, we have to stop and we That's you, fine, we can, we can discuss that. But what? What, yeah. that, that is very different from a prescribing no, no, don't, beliefs don't to me, answer, like he has. Answer. Okay, I will go for one. It is belief, yeah. and we respect it. Okay, yeah. right. we respect right. it. Well, yeah. I don't think it is. No, no we, we don't, don't, we don't. Anyway, we don't. so, 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 let's, let's yeah. have a look at this. Let's yeah. have a look at this. <laughs> we all agree, yes. every one of us agrees that this book doesn't teach belief in three gods. Yes. And you all agree it makes that sense. I believe in this book. Yes. So. You, Logically, you don't believe in three what gods. What makes more sense that I don't believe in three gods, no. or go, that you Hallelujah. are wrong about believing that yes. I do? Yes, yes, yes. Which, which makes more sense? It makes sense. It makes sense now. It makes sense. It makes sense. Good. So, are we all agreed that yes. it makes more sense that you're wrong in thinking that I believe? Yes, he is. Yeah, I'm wrong. 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 I'm wrong.
I'm going to make you look a fool now. Okay. The very first word that she says to the lords is, I pray ye lords be seated. So literally, if you said to me, let's go for a coffee right now, yes, that can be described as prayer. Because the Queen literally says in the House of Lords, I pray ye lords be seated. Okay, okay. Maybe English is not my first language. Exactly. English is not my first language. However, it's not... Is it the same? Is it the same kind of prayer when I say, "Let's go have a coffee"? Apparently, that's a prayer to you. Or is it the that's same? Sir? Please save me! Please, my Lord, save me! Well, well, that's well, not well, the same well, kind of prayer. Right, we're if you ask, I'm not English. You ask me. Hold on one second. If you ask me to do something, yeah, like and if I, you borrow, ask I borrow money God from you, to do something. I beg you, give me what five pounds. That's maybe, maybe it's a prayer. What is the difference? What do you mean? What is the difference? Exactly. You've not thought you through. You've not through your logic. It's not. It's not the only difference. It's like the same thing with the only difference. No sense, the only saying. difference is the person that we're asking of. Yeah, exactly. 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 But the action of you telling me and the action of you asking me or the action of you asking okay. God who are you gonna, is the same. Who are you going to ask for The only to difference save your life? is who we're asking. God. No one else. But that's based on ability. If you come to me and say, lend me a fiver, I might be able to lend you a fiver. Yeah. But if you say, lend me a million quid, I definitely can't lend you a million quid. But if you ask a multimillionaire to this lend you a Jesus quid, he might be able to. to save his life. Jesus asked God to Bro, save his life. You, you, you're sunk, yeah. mate, on this argument. Just let it go. No. Oh, you got yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, no, you got it. Even like you got it. Listen, Bob, 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 God the Father, he will never say that to Jesus. Okay, I, 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 I wonder, God the Father I wonder, doesn't need nobody. I wonder, he need no one, at, but what Jesus point, need the at what point Muslim critics of the Christian faith will actually engage with because the fact that we Christians believe in the Incarnation? No, because... You try to criticize the Trinity and you always... Because you make the Father and the, the incarnation. Son equal. All, All of your shit. arguments. I'm not even criticizing Sorry, let me, let me, let me, let me finish my point. Yeah, because you don't like me shouting. Okay. And I would prefer not to shout. Well, but I will shout if I need to. Yeah. Okay. So, in terms of... in terms, And it ruins his microphone. <laughs> Please, spare the cameraman. It costs him a fortune. So, in terms of... In terms of the, 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 all of these criticisms about Jesus dying on a cross, Jesus praying to the Father, yeah. all of those criticisms... They're not. They're they are fair criticism, though. Fair. They, are, they are fair criticisms, okay. but that Thank means you that you much. honestly have to engage with the answer, which must Muslims here in the park never do because the answer is always the same which is the incarnation when Christ the Logos becomes a man yeah. he's not going to become an atheist is he? Is oh, yeah, he? Yeah. Like he's not going to yeah. become an atheist because if anyone Obey knows that the father wants, exists wants, it's the son Amen. so he's going to speak to his father as a man mm -hmm. even though he did it in is it, is the, it the Bible? Is it the Bible? Is it the One Bible? second. Because okay. then you mentioned about the cross. I'll, I'll show you a verse as well. The thing after, is, as Christians, we believe that what died on the cross was the human flesh, the human nature. We agree with Muslims. The divinity does not die. You go to the Council of Ephesus and the writings of the Council of Ephesus, the correction given at the Council of Ephesus is the idea that the divinity does not die. Okay. It's like me getting, me, it's getting die. me an me iron rod and a wooden it's stick a and chucking them both the into the water. One floats over the top, one sinks to the bottom. Why? Same action, same event, like you. but because of the nature of the things, they behave differently. Okay. So on the cross, the humanity dies, but the divinity does not. Humanity and, dies. and that's what the Bible teaches. What do you mean humanity yeah. dies? That's what the Bible teaches. Okay. Okay, so now, back to this point that I was going the to prayer, make. Okay, the prayer. No, no, we've yeah. dealt with the prayer. No, we don't. No, we haven't. We're now showing. We're now showing. We're now showing, we're now showing about Jesus Christ being the Creator. So I'm going to read two passages. Okay. Okay. Can you read the passage where they say you can't do nothing without? Yeah. I can't do nothing. So, yeah, we're, we're I by myself this. can do nothing. Is that the yeah. one? Thank you. I agree. I agree. Jesus Christ, Only with the in his humanity, even Peter, always so does what he sees Peter, the Father doing. Even Peter, he was testimony of that as well. He says, yeah, again, man, again you're you snippet the, verses the, on not real students. No, you're talking with the, the permission of God. You just take in the Bible. But the thing is, 
is my theology no is my theology as a Christian taken from the snippet verses used by the Dawah team? Or is it taken the from reading the whole the of the scripture? We are doing the same. When, the when Muslims the read the Quran, I'm they use you, all of the Quran or just some of the Quran? I'm telling you, Jesus said he can't do anything by himself. Yes, by himself. and then you take and now these you're gonna verses, read something then you take these verses, so you're doing exactly the same. Then you take these verses and you balance them in the okay, harmony of the whole. Let's weigh the both. You say Jesus says himself yeah. in the Bible, Jesus yeah. himself with the red letter, yeah. uttering from his own mouth, says, I by myself can do, do nothing. nothing. Yeah. Tell us why Jesus himself with the red letter said, I'm God, worship me, or I create this, or I give you this, or I am this. He said, you're going to go. Okay. He will find someone to you, else saying God. about Jesus, not Jesus himself. Jesus said, I'm going to go to you. And he say, accusing us God. of choosing passages. So, what else are you going to read? So, There's going to be more. Firstly, firstly, I don't have to jump through your hoops. No, you I said, know. you said, yeah. you said, show me the red letters. No, no, right, no. You're, then you're I mean, going to go to Jesus no, no, right. Do I have to shout? Because Jesus or are you going to let me more. speak? Okay. Or do I have to raise my voice? Please don't. Please don't. Please. Right. <laughs> then you have to let me speak, bro. Okay. He's angry. Please. No, not angry. But I've just learned that in these kinds of contexts, sometimes this brother gets a little excitable, starts no, to lose no, control no. of himself, true, 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 true. and I have to raise okay. my voice to get my voice. You, you have a right to remind me. Yeah. So. Firstly, my theology is dependent on the whole of the Bible, not just the bits that you want me to use. So let's read this. God, after he spoke long ago to the fathers and the prophets in many portions and in many ways, in these last days has spoken to us in his Son, whom he appointed heir of all things, through whom also he made the world. Through, through whom he made the world. So, so the Father creates it was the way. through the Son. It was the way. Through. That is what the Bible teaches. That is what the Bible teaches. It might not be what the Dawah team tell you, oh, no, but that is what the Bible teaches. They've got nothing to do with the Dawah right, team. Yes, I know. Now, let's go, let's go back to, let's go back to Jesus saying, I am God, worship me. Yes. That yeah. was one thing. That's right. That, that, that is cool. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to show you where Jesus calls himself God and says heavily if you find it. Yeah, I'm going to show you. It didn't take me very long. Okay. Right. Which passage reference please? Yes, John chapter 5, verse 22. Did you get that? Yes. Have you added that to your notes? No, no, it's in my head. Yeah, you're going to study it when you go home? Yes. Brilliant. Did you get that? Yeah, yeah. John 5, 22. 5, 22. 5, 22. John 5, 22. Yeah. Listen to this. Not even the Father judges anyone, but he has given all judgment to the Son so that all will honour the Son, even as they honour the Father. Right, so you honour Jesus Christ like you honour Allah. No, 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 ah, so you don't do it then? No, 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 no. Now listen, I honour I, I honor my mum, my father, yeah, like brilliant. I honour Muhammad. Brilliant. Now listen carefully to what Jesus said. Listen carefully to what Jesus said. I'm going to insert the word Allah to replace Father, so you can hear the full significance of what Jesus said, because we all agree that the Father of the Bible is equivalent to Allah. Listen. Yeah. For not even Allah judges anyone, but he has given all judgment to the Son, so that all will honour the Son, who speaks even as they honour Allah. That's that not is Jesus, Jesus speaking. Wait, wait, wait. It's in the red letters, the very thing he asked me to show him, where Jesus said, I am God, worship me, in the red letters. I've just so, shown you in the red letters. Are you telling me now? Are you telling me now? Are you telling me? Are you telling me that now? Jesus, Jesus says worship, this, worship and then me. he says somewhere else. Worship. Honoring I'm God. Well, first of all, honoring somebody doesn't mean worshiping yeah. Him. So, so, honoring somebody. I honor my mom. Oh, yeah. I don't worship her. Now, 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 I honor my mom. Now, 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 you, you seem rattled, guys. But you you seem rattled. No, 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 no. You no, seem no, no. rattled, Bob, guys. it's not fair. You, you said, seem rattled. You said, I will give you, you a passage me to show you where Jesus said, worship me. Hold on, one Did second. Did he say that or no? Hold on, one He's second. He's on the camera. Yes. Did he say that? Can I answer? But you Can I answer? Worship is a problem. Can I answer? Yes. Right, are we all listening? Yes. Because once again, I have to give you a lesson in the English language. Oh dear! Once again, I have to give you a lesson in the English language. Now, I am actually, I have taught English as a foreign language. I did it when I was in Colombia, so you're literally talking to someone who's in English. 
There we go. Are you listening? Right. Because we are speaking to two people who know so much about what Christians believe and so much about what I believe. Yeah? And all Christians. They are going to tell me where the word worship comes from. Where, where, where does the word worship come from? Shall I tell you the history of the word worship? Okay. The word, the word worship, the word worship. Are you listening? You're going to miss your English lesson here. This is really interesting stuff. I'm educating you. I'm educating you. I didn't even know Jesus was English. I didn't even know that. Wow. Not listening. I really didn't know Jesus Are you listening? Yes. Go ahead. Okay. So the word worship comes from the word we are skipping. It's from the Middle English. Yeah, Middle so English. So it's like, it's not Anglo-Saxon English. Yeah. It's the Middle English before our current English. Yeah. Okay. So it's an old thing. And what it means is to give due honour. Everybody say to give due honour. To give due honour. Due honour. Due honour. Due honour. Middle English. Are you listening? Do you, do you worship your own? Are you listening? Do you listen. worship your own parents? Are you listening? listen. Guys, listen. do you worship your own parents? Listen. Your mom and listen. your father? Hey. Please say. Listen. Listen. <laughs> listen. Right. So let me give you an example. Because he doesn't know the use of the word English. He doesn't know that one of the titles of a judge in the court is his worshipness. Yes, it is. Why would it be his worshipness? Why can you address a judge in a court as his worship? To honor him. To honor him. Exactly. So we can honor our mothers and fathers. We can honor one another. And I can pray to him for a coffee. No, 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 so in the same way? No, not in the same no, way. Why not? Why not? Not in the same way. But now you've helped me prove my point. Why you change? Why you change? Bro, listen, I've sunk you. Listen, listen. Listen, listen. Now he sunk me. He said, but not in the same way. And I agree. So listen to what Jesus said. Jesus said, so that all will honor the Son even as they honor the Father. We win. You lose. Thank you very much. Do, do you honor your mum and your father? Yes, of course I do. Same way. No, not the same way I worship God. No, no worship. Honoring God. I, the, these words are interchangeable. Did you not listen to the English lesson? English lesson. This is an English lesson. You says worship. Worship. No honor. What does worship mean? Worship is. To pray to no, no, we are skipping. <laughs> no, that's prayer. You don't know English, bro. Prayer means supplication. Yeah. We are skipping means to give you honor. You need to speak oh, no. all English. Can, can you You've already you admitted you don't know the history of the language. Yeah. You've already we said that yes, English yes. isn't your first language. We didn't even know Jesus but speak but English. Suddenly now they're so scholars of the English oh, language. We didn't even know Jesus, Jesus spoke English. English. So, oh, we didn't okay. even know that. You've just made your problems worse. Yeah. Yeah. Because the word honor yeah. is the word doxa. It's where we get orthodoxy from. Orthodoxy, orthodoxy means right worship. Right worship. Right worship. So, the word here is worship because it's the word doxa in the greek so you're wrong in english you're wrong in the greek and yet they still think they're right do they use the word worship means pray do they use the word worship means pray so i want you to deal with the point no 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 the word worship did that mean to pray to jesus so listen no wait i have answered your questions multiple times you need to answer my question. Yeah. Would you honor a prophet in the same way that you honor Allah? No. No. Yes. But Jesus says, honor me as, as you, you honor Allah. Allah. <laughs> Why that's would he do that? That's not Quran. That's not Quran. Ah, it's not the Quran. But we were never talking you about the Quran. You said, show me in the Bible. I show you in the Bible. And now he's saying, but that's not the Quran. That's not how we got to John 5:22. You mentioned Allah. Bro, just accept. No, you yeah. don't know what you're doing. You've lost yeah, the debate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you've lost the debate because 
all you do is listen to Golden Shower Boy over there <laughs> rather than actually study the Bible with Christians. That's not Jesus' teaching to me. So, give people's name. I want you to deal with this. Jesus never teach you to give people's name. Tell me, tell me this, tell me this. Jesus says, one second. Jesus says, honor him as you honor the Father. Will you do that? Why? Jesus said, God's Father. And Jesus answer the question. Jesus said, I'm not like the one, one that sent me. One yeah. and Jesus said, answer. Jesus said, Jesus said, I am not like the one that sent me. Yeah. Exactly. End of story. The Father is not the Son. And the Son is not the Father. The Bible said, God is not a man. And you you says God is a man. No, you misquoted the passage. No, you misquoted no, again. It said, it said, you don't know English. It said, should I lie? I don't know English. We don't like a man. That's what it says. You can misquote the Bible. Heavens on earth. This is why I have to raise my voice. Because of excited butthurt Muslims who don't like to lose an argument even though the evidence is presented to them fairly and squarely. So, so, no. I want, I, I've answered, I've been very charitable and I've answered question after question from you. I want to you to answer one of my questions. Jesus says that you should, Jesus says, Jesus says that you should honour him as you honour the Father. Will you do that? No, no. Why not? Because he's a prophet. Because, God. God. because he's not no, God. No, 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 so in other words, hey, if Jesus Rabbi, listen, said, Rabbi, "Honor listen, me as you honor Rabbi, the Father," Rabbi, 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 they acknowledge listen, that listen, Jesus that just called himself God and worshipped me. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I'll answer the question. Why we cannot abide by that? Because one of the ten no one asked this shush, question. Shush, shush, shush. You're interfering shush, in my shush, conversation. Shush, shush. Because you know why? You're going to be I'm made quiet. Having a conversation You're going to be made quiet two. by your own book. He said, one of the ten commandments. Don't bow down to any graven image on the heavens or earth. Yeah. Where was that? Where is that? In the Bible. End of story. So why do Muslims bow down and kiss a rock? So why do Muslims bow down and kiss a rock? He knows, he knows, he knows. He knows, he knows, he knows. He's a rock. He kiss a rock. I kiss my mom as well. He's just compared his mother to a rock in Mecca. Is that honoring your mother? You just compared a rock in Mecca to your mother. How dishonorable. You are dishonest. How dishonorable. You you your mother, I'm your mother says, deserves bow more down, respect than that. Bow down, pray to the stone and your mother God deserves more respect than that. But kill me somebody who doesn't mean what it makes me feel. In your God, what does that mean? Realize. Don't bow down to any great image on the heavens or earth. What does that mean? Yeah. So, so you mean you bow down to No, brother, brother. Yeah, yeah. What you've done, what you've done, need that, need that fishing is you, you've misquoted, you've misquoted yeah. scripture. No, I haven't. Your arguments are unconvincing, and let me explain yeah. why they're unconvincing. I worship the God of Jesus. One, they are unconvincing because you don't understand the words that you're using. They are unconvincing because you don't know the Bible you're quoting. They are unconvincing because you're attacking theology. Jesus without an understanding of that story. Uh, that's what you do. Uh, you do to make me understand. You haven't been a Of course, because you started this conversation by saying that you could tell me what I believe. If the cup is full, you can't add anything into it. Exactly, so he's finished where he started. So in other words, he was never a student of knowledge. He was never a student of knowledge. Show me where it says I believe in three gods in this book. Jesus is God. You show me. You believe Jesus is God. You I believe in one God. I believe in one God. Is it Jesus God? Listen, is it Jesus God? Yes. Is the Father God? Yes. Is the Holy Spirit God? Yes. Is the God? Is the Hafs Quran the Quran? What? Is the Hafs Quran the Quran? I don't believe it. I'm a Jimmy Hafs. What about the Hafs? Is it Quran? The Quran is not Hafs. Which Quran? Hafs? Wash? Duri? Al Ansar. Which Quran? Al Ansar. Can I ask you? Hafs, Wash, or Duri? First of all, first of all, Quran is not written. Quran was Quran. Now that's not my question. Is the Hafs have the Quran? Say must. Have. Is the half of the Quran? No! Ask him again! No! Did you, he just said the half no. is not the Quran! No! There you go! So, guys, he doesn't believe in the half's Quran! What about the wash Quran? Wash, wash, half. 
is must have scripture. Wash in half. Wash in half. How many Qurans is that? It's scripture. How many Qurans is that? One. One. So when he says that half and wash equals one, that's okay. But if I say that the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit are one, that's not okay. That's what he's just done. It's called double standards. Double standards. You've made no case. This no, God no, God. 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 Made no case. Yeah. 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 Made no case, Miss King. You yes, we have made a case. You comparing yes, God. We made a case. You comparing God and Jesus with Hafs and Wash. Can you believe it? It's much. It doesn't make much difference. So are you suggesting that the Hafs and the Wash are not the word of Allah? We see the no, I'm not saying that. I'm saying no. Oh, so they are the word of Allah. But you said Quran. Are they the word of Allah? Do you know Quran? Are they the word of Allah? Do you know Quran? What means? Answer the question. Do you know what is Quran? Mean? Oh. Yes. Yes, they are. Yes. Right. Yes. So if they are the word of Allah. Yeah. Can you say that they are not one of the attributes of Allah? Because you just said the part I of his knowledge the is, the is, a, is a part of God. Is a part you believe that the hafs and the wash are the word of God. Is a part of his knowledge. So he says no. I don't think knowledge. the Muslims know what they believe. I don't think the Muslims know what they believe. You try to say Quran is God, it's not God. So it's an attribute. You can even attribute of God. So is it Allah one or multiple? You've just said that it, Allah's knowledge, it's Allah's knowledge, but it's not Allah. So is Allah one or not? Allah is one. Yes. Allah so Allah, Allah is his knowledge then? No, it's not. Ah, so that's two then? Allah is Allah. Allah is Allah. Allah. No, you're a teacher. Taweed, what does he mean? You're a teacher. What does Taweed mean? Unity of God. Unity. To have a unity, is that meaning more than one? To be unified? No. Ah, so how can you have unity then? So it means one alone. You said unity. No, no, now you're changing it. Which story should I believe? The first one or the second one? I can't help him. What does Taweed mean? One or unity? I'm trying to go on your level to make you understand what means Taweed. You said Taweed means unity. Then when I pointed out that you had to have a duplicity to have unity, you said it meant one. So who do I believe? Your first answer or your second answer? Do you want to understand? The second one. What? The second one. The second one. Right, so Allah is one. You clearly you don't understand Arabic. Allah is one. I'll give you the second one. Let's deal with that. Allah is one unique. Right, so he right. said, because you don't understand, I give Allah you the second one. one. So I actually think yeah. the Taweed might mean unity. No, it doesn't. It just give you it doesn't. Okay. I says, so now, hey, now, let's look one at One alone. Right, fine. One alone. Fine, one alone. Yes. So, in what way is Allah one? In any way or shape In or any form. way, every yes. shape and form. Yes. So, I can then say that Allah's word is Allah and Allah's... No. Ah, no. so now we've created no. a duplicity in the one. Now you're mixing between his attributes. Yes. Yes. With his oneness. His With his oneness. his name. Ah, hold on. Yeah. You said yeah. that the Quran is the knowledge of Allah. Yeah. But that Allah's knowledge is not Allah. Allah is not the knowledge, yeah. And there the we go. Allah. So it's that like means you, you speak, you have the knowledge. One second. The knowledge is not Bob, and is Bob is not, not the knowledge. Is Allah's knowledge eternal? Is Allah's knowledge living? Yes. Is Allah's knowledge? Is Ali, uh, the knowledge of Allah limited no, no. in any way? No. How is this not God? What do you mean that's not God? How is that not God? What do you mean how is not God? Because it's his nature. He's, 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 he's so I'll tell you what you've got, bro. So I'll tell you what you've got. So are you saying God, God by himself, eternal, but his knowledge, he took it upon him. So I'll tell you what I'm saying. What are you talking about? Shall I tell you what I'm saying? What are you talking about? Shall I tell you what I'm and saying? His knowledge oh, he doesn't want to listen now. Along. Came along. He doesn't want to listen now. <laughs> What do you mean about God? He doesn't is, want to listen now. Eternal. Shall I tell you what I'm saying? What are you saying? I am saying. Let's be calm, bro. I know you're rattled. I know you're up against the road. I know you're backed in the corner. But we can relax. I know you're backed up. But we can relax. Come on, 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 come on,
If you're united or joined, that implies multiplicity. What, what is the United Kingdom? What is the United States? Well, well, you tell me what is united in your definition. Taweed, if I understand it, means unity. If I understand the word Taweed properly, and again, I'm open to correction, but it means unity. Would you agree if it does mean oneness? I, 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 I think that Taweed, when you look at the root of the word, it means unity. And unity implies multiplicity coming together. I just read it, you showed it me, and it said joined or united. Yeah. Uni unity, unity and numbers are not the same thing. You're, con you're making a category mistake. You're confusing. You can explain most physical processes through mathematics, but the reality is if you, if, if you look at anything that we explain with mathematics, it's always a combination of things. I have no idea. I don't work for him and he don't work for me. No, 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 we, 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 we meet and work here. Yeah. But, but that was off camera, right? Yeah. I know, but still, I'd rather not be with Yeah. So, he was recording. And he has every right to record. Yeah. I know, but I asked him to be with him. So, I mean, the thing is, you can't stand in a place where there's loads of cameras and then say I don't want to be on camera. It's just, it's just not a reasonable request. Yeah, for that, for that last one, you, 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 can't, you can't blur it. Yeah, we're, we're not going to blur it when you were standing in the audience. Yeah. You chose to stand yeah, there. That's true. Uh, I just wanted to make a suggestion. So, so my point is, if, uh, the, 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 uh, the contradiction. Are you recording all the time? Let me ask you this question. I'm not having, I'm not having this question with you. Let me ask you. So, so, okay, let me just do a wrap up with him, and if you want me, and you can talk over at the railings. Yeah, right. Right, but what happened there before the the Aji Baji? What happened there? So basically, I, I I was trying to approach Hijab Golden Shower, but um, he he was in a debate with a sister, and then I got talking to some Muslims who may or may not be trying to recruit uh, a Christian lady. I don't know, um, and we got talking about Christian theology, and as always, as always, the Dawah team and the da people who follow the Dawah script started off by telling me what I believe. I'm just thinking, shall we move away from him or can you hear me fine? Okay. So they started off by telling me what I believe. I believe in three gods, they said. So then I asked them, where in the Bible, do we agree that the Bible teaches that there's only one God? And they all said yes. And then I said, do we all agree that I believe in the Bible? And they all went yes. And then I said, so is it logical to assume that I won't believe in three gods? And they went, no. And that's the, that's the cognitive dissonance of people who listen to the Dawah script. If you think like that, Muslim, you're not thinking, you're just repeating. If you're thinking, you will logically go, Bob believes in the Bible, the Bible teaches one God, therefore Bob believes in one God. It's very logical, very simple. So then we went on to talk about the fact, sorry, we actually started by showing that the earliest Christians worship God as Father, Son and Holy Spirit. And I showed that through quoting the martyrdom of Polycarp. And as always, they wanted to ignore some words whilst listening to other words. And that's something you've got to watch out for. So then I went, they said, sh they, then they started attacking the Trinity based on the implications of the Incarnation, which is exactly what Muslims do all the time. They ignore the doctrine of the Incarnation to attack the Trinity without recognising that we Christians believe in the Trinity and the Incarnation. And all their criticisms of the Trinity are answered by a knowledge of the Incarnation. 
that Christ in his humanity prayed to his Father, Christ in his humanity died, Christ in his humanity had limited access to his divine knowledge. Doesn't mean it wasn't there. So then we started talking a bit more about the Trinity and they said, show me where Jesus says, I am God, worship me. John chapter 5, 22. Honour me as you honour the Father, so that all might honour the Son as they honour the Father. Muslims all agree that the Father is the equivalent to Allah. So you can replace the word Father with the word Allah. So Jesus is saying, honour the Son as you honour Allah. Which means, Jesus is God and worship him. And I asked the Muslims, I said, hold on a minute, would you honour Jesus as you honour Allah? They said no. Why, I asked them. And they said, ah, because he's not God. Which means that when Jesus says, honour me as you honour the Father, he is saying, I am God, worship me. Now, then they said, oh, honour and worship are not the same word. And I had to give them a little English lesson in what the word prayer means and what the word worship means. Prayer means to make supplication, to ask someone to do something. Doesn't matter who you ask. The next thing is worship. We are skippy, worship means to give due honour. The word doxa in Greek means to give honour, to give divine glory, to give glory to God. So Jesus is saying, honour him, worship him, glorify him as you honour the Father. That only makes sense if Jesus is saying that he is God. So, brothers and sisters, if you're following the narrative of the Dawa team, you are being lied to. What you need to do is stop taking the snippet verses that you've learnt from Golden Shower Hijab, <laughs> Shamsi Gonthalus, I don't know my Trinity Hashim, or Mansour, show me where Jesus is the God of Israel, I am the first and the last. These are the things that you need to do. You need to study the Christian faith with knowledgeable Christians. If you want to talk to me, send me an email btbsoco at gmail.com bravo tango sierra oscar charlie oscar at gmail.com i literally try to reply to every single person that writes to me so correspondence is a bit slow but i do eventually get around to replying to everybody i hope so study with christians and if you want I'll set up a study group on Zoom specifically for Muslims. Wow. And we will study the Bible wow. together. And all I ask you to do is just study it honestly. If you study it with me for a number of weeks and you're not convinced, fine. But at least be honest in studying what the scriptures say. It's not a hard thing to ask. So there you go. God bless. God bless. Well, praise the Lord.